And still in domestic news, China is on course to build its first ever third generation nuclear power plant in Sanmen in East China's Zhejiang province. Now the technology is, that is at the core of the plant, which is known as AP-1000. That is a U.S. developed third generation technology that's at the heart of the largest ever joint China-U.S. energy project. Our reporter Ying Yuan has more. A last inspection for this 800-ton steel structure. This containment vessel will be lifted up to a height of 65 meters to caps nuclear power unit. It marks the completion of the main structure. The reactor and the steam generator are already sitting inside, waiting to be installed. Three years on from the beginning of the project, the security remains very tight. We follow the rules of the U.S. Nuclear Regulatory Commission as well as China's own nuclear safety laws and regulations. Our team consists of talented people from both China and the U.S., and we have a comprehensive system of quality control. Since Japan's Fukushima disaster, preventing cooling system failure has become a key safety priority for the nuclear industry worldwide. The salmon plant uses U.S. AP-1000 technology, otherwise known as third-generation nuclear technology. It means the plant's emergency cooling system can function without electricity for three days. Third generation is, according to the such kind of PSA you know, analysis, is 100, 100 times more safer than the generation two. They can actually operate without any power, and they just be forced by the gravity, natural secretions, so they can make these systems work very well. The salmon plant will stop generating electricity in 2014 and is expected to supply 15 percent of Zhejiang province electricity by 2015. It's a part of China's overall plan to increase the proportion of nuclear power to 4 percent by 2020, double the current level. The electricity made by one nuclear unit here can save 3 million tons of coal and decrease carbon emissions by 8 million tons. Different countries hold different opinions on nuclear power development, especially after Fukushima accident. However, developing clean and efficient energy is always a common goal for everyone, and ensuring safety is always a top priority. In Yuan, CCTV, Simon County, Zhejiang Province.